Geschichte. Hello friends, you are welcome. Before we begin today's tutorial, please find the link above to download and subscribe to Filmora Wondership. It comes with a special discount for you. Enjoy. I am using just 12 pictures, so let's start by going to stock media to drag down a white color background as shown. Now extend it to 36 seconds or click the duration icon above the timeline, then adjust it to 36 seconds. Next, go up and click on Template. Under Split Screen Basic, I scrolled down to drag down a split screen, then went back up to untick the animation as shown. I then went back again to drag down more split screen templates and turned off the animation as shown. Now I went up to Media to drag four different pictures into the split screen template and made the necessary adjustments to fit them into the split grid as shown. So I continued to do the same for the rest of the split screen templates by going to Media to insert different pictures and I made the necessary adjustments until the last one as shown. Now I go up to Media. Under Editing Preset, I find and drag down an adjustment layer, then extend it to match the duration below. Next, I went up to Effect to drag and apply the border effect to the adjustment layer. Then I clicked on the layer, went back up to Effect, and reduced the border size to 2 so that it aligns with the split screen borders. Afterward, I moved the playhead to the middle of each split screen and took a snapshot, continuing until the last split screen, as shown, making a total of four snapshots. Now, select all the split screens and the adjustment layer, then delete them as shown. Next, drag down the first snapshot and extend it to 15 seconds as shown. Then click and go up to apply the keyframe to transform. In the position X field, type minus 1980 as shown. So I moved the playhead forward to the end, then went up to apply a keyframe to transform. Then I deleted the minus sign from minus 1980, making it 1980, as shown. Then I previewed it. Now, I move the playhead back to 7 seconds, then drag the picture upward while holding the Alt key to duplicate it in position, as shown. Again, I move the playhead back to 14 seconds, then drag the picture upward while holding the Alt key to duplicate it in position, as shown. Lastly, I move the playhead back to 21 seconds, then drag the picture upward while holding the Alt key to duplicate it in position, as shown. Now, I scrolled down to the second snapshot, then went up to Media to drag down the second snapshot while pressing and holding the Alt key to replace the snapshot on the timeline. I did the same for the third and last snapshots on the timeline, as shown. As you preview, you will notice that the border lines align well as it animates, as shown.
Now select all, then right click to apply a compound clip as shown. Lastly, go up to effect. Search for and drag down the shiny golden overlay effect above, then extend it to match the duration below. After that, preview your work. Thanks for watching. The template for the tutorial is in the description, along with the link to download Filmora at a discounted price. Have a wonderful day.